Kang look better. Three, two, one. Is Cammy a cop? Claire, do you think Cameo students are hot? <laughs> huh? Do you think Cameo students are hot? Are hot? Yes. Like on average? Sure. <laughs> do I get like a scale of like one to ten, or just like no, yes just or yes, no? yes or no? Yeah. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> do you think Cameo students are hot? No. <laughs> okay. <that's> okay. <laughs> hey Charlie, do you think uh, Kamek students are hot? Uh, I think uh, Alex is hot. <laughs> <laughs> are are Kamek students hot? I think everyone is beautiful in their own way. Shut up, Trent. <laughs> that does not make sense. <laughs> <That's> so false. <laughs> I have a really good. Answer this question. Okay, okay. I feel like every person, every person can agree with it. Um, ooh, wait, is it that I say this? He might be watching. Um, he's in my stats class. Um, <laughs> the guys here, they gotta be black. But for the girls, have you seen a girl that's not hot? <laughs> everyone can confirm this. You walk down the hallways, everyone looks like. From New York fashion, that they're from some kind of like, like it boggles my head. Like, where did they come from? Like, like we don't know their origin, but they're here at Camiac. Why at Camiac? Why at Camiac? When they should be like somewhere except here. Hey guys. <laughs> we're, all, we're, all, we're all very handsome. <laughs> all right. Hey, thank you. With the prevalence of COVID-19 in the past years, our group realized the importance and vital information that one's temperature could provide in order to explore whether or not the using the average temperature of the body would be a good comparison to indicate the health of Kamiak's community, we set out to survey our classmates. Therefore, our question was, are Kamiak students hot? Meaning, do they exceed the average body temperature of 98.6? In order to meet the minimum requirements of sampling 30 subjects or more for our one sample t-test for means, our group decided to sample 8 people from 4 different classes for a total of 32 temperatures taken. Within each class, we assign each student a number and use the random number generator to select 8 students without replacement who we would ask for consent to measure their temperatures and recorded it in Fahrenheit. Because we collected data from one sample and were looking for the population mean from a sample mean, we used a one sample t-test for the means. Throughout the experiment, the true population mean was the temperature of human foreheads about 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. Our null hypothesis was that the sample mean of temperatures would equal 98.6, and our alternative hypothesis was that the sample mean of temperatures was greater than 98.6. After collecting our 32 samples, we calculated a p-value of 0.99 against a significance value of 0.05, and as a result, failed to reject the null hypothesis because we did not have sufficient evidence to support that Kamiak students are hotter the 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. This is it. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> Take three. Are you gonna ask the question? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Is Cameo caught? Oh wait, can we do it? I need to ask him.